Hello, my name is Jamie Hera and today I will be making crystals! This looks very interesting. Hmm, I wonder what's inside here. Wow! There are so many experiments I can do. We have grow and big. We have chemical frost. And lastly, we have fool's gold. I think, hmm, what should I pick? I think I should pick fool's gold. We have the fool's gold experiment here. It says to mix some of this sodium into a test tube. What you're gonna need for this experiment is you need a test tube, naso, Q4 fact CNC. It's a very con um it's a very detailed. And we also need pyrite. We also need a big spoon and small spoon too in case. We also need boiling water. Be careful and make sure you don't drop it. First, we need to take our test tube and open it up. We need to get our naso. So first, what we need to do is we need to put a big spoon of naso. Be careful, we don't want more than a big spoon. And remember, it's this big spoon, not the big spoon that we use for eating into the test tube. Next, we need five drops of this. Once again, remember not to drop your test tube or not, it'll go everywhere. We need to put five drops of this. One, two, three, four, five. Next, we need to take one small spoon of pyrite. You can always put the cover back on so you don't need to keep holding it. When you open the pyrite, remember to use your small spoon, this small spoon from the large spoon from last time. Next, you need to put the pyrite into the test tube and shake it and remember to put your cover shake it for 20 seconds one two three four five six seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty next when you're done you need to get your boiling water you need to put your test tube in for 20 minutes it's done now let's check the result wow the water has turned to blue as you can see i'm gonna try to put the liquid out let's pour it here Now the gold has become more black and has became a little bit yellowish. It looks though like it feels like real gold as it's really hot. So let's pick it up. As you can see here, this is fool's gold. It has turned a little bit yellowish and blackish because it looks like it's real gold but it's actually called fool's gold because it's not actually gold. It is really hot now and it looks like it's like gold and like a material of gold. I'm gonna be telling you some tips. Tip one, when you have the boiling water, make sure you don't put the boiling water at the start of the experiment because you might find stuff difficult and it might become cold water. 
and we don't want that or it can't become full scope. Tip 2. Be careful when you are pouring the boiling water into another cup or putting the test tube into the boiling water. Make sure you don't drop the test tube into the boiling water or not you have to pick it up and your hands will get maybe even get burned. Make sure you don't mess up the liquids. We only need three of this. We don't need liquids. So. If I made a mistake of switching this with this, it will become awfully wrong and there is no full score and just a big fail. Make sure you read the manual before make, doing the experiment or not you made your liquids up. Hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to subscribe and like and hit the notification bell to all. Bye bye!